It's the story of a life taken too soon and those left behind. A Sudbury family is sharing its journey with cancer in hopes that smokers will quit the habit and others won't start. CTV's Tamara Shanko reports. I was 18 when I met my husband. He proposed to me on my 19th birthday and we were married when I was 21. On my 30th birthday, he was diagnosed with lung cancer. He was only 34 years old. To share a life is to save a life. 16 years after she lost her husband to cancer, a Sudbury woman and her three sons are going public with their family's journey with the disease. They know firsthand what it is and what cigarette smoking does to uh, their loved one uh, growing up without a father. Eight years after her husband's death, Shomal gave her sons a special gift, a video in memory of their dad. It included a final Father's Day, even a TV interview Bob Shomal gave before his death. But the video also came with a surprise revelation from its producer. He um, had shown the video to a couple of people that were not familiar with our story and were smokers, and because of it, they quit smoking. So um, today, and from that moment on, I always had that dream or that passion or goal that we needed to do something about this because it was powerful enough. Denise Shoma would go on to dedicate her nursing career to cancer patients, and that video would later be turned into a teaching tool with the help of her now grown sons. I remember, you know, my mom was super strong, so was my dad. I'm the proudest mom and he's the proudest dad and uh, he's looking down on them and I know he has a smile from ear to ear. While sharing her family's story has been part of a healing journey, Shoma has also discovered a newly found passion for public speaking and she hopes to bring her message to area schools. Tamara Shanko, CTV News, Sudbury.